After a slow start to this one, what did it take in the second half to kind of turn things around? You outscored them 37-21 in that third quarter. Orlando's a scrappy team. We knew that. Um, they were going to come out energized, especially after they went against the Knicks. You know, they were rolling a little bit. Um, you know, Coach Moe's got them rolling over there, so we knew they were going to come out with confidence. We took that punch, and, and we did what we did. We gathered up, you know, and, and played our basketball. Season high in scoring for you. How satisfying is it knowing that, you know, everybody needed to step up with so many guys down. Bruce Brown goes down during the game, too. But with your performance, how satisfying was it to contribute the way that you did? Um, whatever it takes for us to win, you know, that's what I'm here for. You know, five minutes, ten minutes, whatever it takes. Um, today I was fortunate enough to play and uh, contribute and give my guys some shots. James, how big was one markers for you guys on the stretch? You had those two baskets the final minute to kind of seal the win. Uh, he he been doing that forever. Like I like I said, I'm I'm happy he's off my scouting report and on my team now. Man. He's tough. He he been hitting clutch buckets like that his his whole career. And you know the uh, maestro James Harden was was not reluctant to find him during down the stretch and uh, shows a lot of character in his leadership as well. And just what worked for you guys on that 10 0 run towards the end of the second quarter and then into that big third quarter? Uh, just, just believing our defensive schemes and executing it. You know, we wasn't really executing, we wasn't really talking. Like I said, as soon as we buckled down, um, realized that this team was in here for real, then we, then we figured it out.